drivers behind the lines in three, two, one, go. Getting a nice start to match number 69 here at IRI. Over on blue, we have two game pieces scored up top, two down below. Strike Force going back for a second cube and scoring. Over on the red side, they've been able to score five game pieces so far with the Highlanders adding in another cube under the wire. Each alliance was able to have a robot be fully engaged. That's going to help them out with their activation bonus later on in the match. And blue is coming into Teleop with a slight advantage, leading red by two points coming out of auto. Strike Force scored another cone up top on a high node. That's going to earn them five points. They're now heading over to grab another game piece from their human player substation. Unfortunately for the Red Alliance, it looks like the Highlanders have lost communication near the Blue Alliance's substation. They caught a penalty for that, but it looks like they're out of the protected zone now. Hopefully they can regain communications with the field. A minute and a half remaining, Blue has pulled ahead. They are 13, 13 points ahead of the Red Alliance. 180 Spam, currently ranked sixth this morning here at IRI, placing a cone on a mid node. The Red Alliance has one link scored so far. They need five more to get their sustainability bonus. Blue Alliance has one more than Red. They only need four more to get their sustainability bonus. Strike Force scoring a cube, snatching up another one with their floor intake and extending up to score it in a mid node again. Their partner, Bedford Express, has a cone that they're working on scoring for the Blue Alliance. We have 50 seconds remaining. 180 Spam scored a link in the high row for the Red Alliance. That means they now only need four more links to get their sustainability bonus. Their partner, Cyber Knights, just missed a cone placement, but Spam is right behind them with another cone, hopefully trying to catch up with Blue, who is leading by 10 points. Purple Precision's MO this match has been to help their alliance feed uh, game pieces into their community so Bedford and Strike Force can better score. This has worked out well for them. Red is leading by nine points with 15 seconds remaining. Excuse me, blue is leading. Now Strike Force lining up, getting ready to help out their teammates balance. Bedford placing one more game piece with five seconds remaining as blue goes to balance on the charge station. Two, one, they've got it right as time expires and two red robots are up and engaged on the charge station as well. We have our results for match 69, and it's going to the Blue Alliance. A really nice showing from these six teams. All six possible ranking points were earned during that match. Blue Alliance scored 184 points to Red's 160. All three Blue Robots moving up in the rankings as a result. Spam actually getting knocked out of the top eight, now down to number 12. Their partners moving down in the rankings as a result too. Congratulations to our three winning Blue Alliance teams.